September 9, the Catholic Church celebrates St. Peter's Claver, a Jesuit missionary who spent his life in the service of African slaves. Peter Claver was born into a farming family in Spanish region, Catalonia, during 1581. He studied at the University of Barcelona as a young man and joined the Jesuit at the novice age of 20. While studying philosophy in Tarragona, Peter developed a friendship with the older Jesuit lay brother Alphonsus Rodriguez. Although Alphonsus spent his days doing menial work as a doorkeeper, he had immense insight spiritual matters that encouraged Peter to become a missionary of the Spanish colonies. In 1610, Peter Claver, a priest, arrived in Cartagena, in the poor city of present-day Colombia. Despite Pope Paul's repeated condemnations of slavery during the previous century, European colonists continued to importing African slaves, often sold by their own rulers to work in plantations and in mines. Those who survived in a ship journey would expect to work to death by their masters. Peter was determined to sacrifice his own freedom to bring the material aid and eternal salvation to the African slaves. In keeping with his vow to become the slave of the blacks forever, the young priest made and kept the resolution despite his own health problems. The language barrier between himself and the population he served in order to minister the speaker of the foreign language. Peter often employed pictorial representation of Catholic truths. He also communicated by the means of generosity, expressions of love, giving them food, drink to the ailing worker and visiting them the bouts of sickness and that often proved fatal. We must speak to them with our hands. He reasoned before we try to speak to them with our lips. In keeping with his vow of slavery, Peter survived on minimal amounts of food and sleep. His life of humility and penance led to miraculous occurrences as when he healed the sick by the touch of his cloak and appeared surrounded by the supernatural light during his hospital visits. St. Peter Claver's work came to an end with his death on September 8, 1654. He had baptized and taught that faith more than 3 lakh slaves during his four decades in Catagena. I am Elston Aaron Pereira from Mother of Torres Church, Udipi. Thank you.